What is up, YouTube? It is your boy, Big Cool, coming to you from Colossal Sports TV. And I am back with another video, final video of the day. Um, Deontay Wilder continues to troll Anthony Joshua and Eddie Hearn. But before we get into the video, go ahead and smash that like button. Hit that subscribe button and that post notification bell to get notified every time I upload content to the channel. Also, share these videos all over social media. Drop your comments in the comment section down below. Now let's get back into the video. Like I said, WBC heavyweight champion Deontay the Bronze Bummer Wilder continues to troll Eddie Hearn and Anthony Joshua. Uh, he just put out like 35 minutes ago on Instagram that every man that, that ever got in the ring with Deontay Wilder has gotten knocked the fuck out. And that is a true fact. He also put in the caption, he only needs six weeks to get ready for Joshua. Hashtag Bronze Bummer. And he's responding to an article that was put out earlier today where Eddie Hearn said he will not allow Anthony Joshua to take this fight with only eight weeks of preparation, which is two months. And it seems like a new roadblock. Although I think ultimately the fight gets done. It does look bad on Eddie Hearn and Anthony Joshua's behalf because there's always something constantly popping up. Either you want the fight or you don't want the fight. There's no in-between. You can't be on the fence. Either you want to face Deontay Wilder and attempt to become the undisputed unified champion of the heavyweight division, or you want to face Alexander Povetkin in September um, and defend your WBA and WBO uh, heavyweight titles against your mandatory, as well as the IBF. You know, it's one or the other. You know, you can't keep saying one thing if you're Eddie Hearn or if you're Anthony Joshua, then contradicting yourself. It's pretty simple. This is the fight everybody in boxing wants to see. Deontay Wilder wants it. He's mulling over the offer right now. He received the contract uh, Monday, and him and his team are going over it. I think that he um, is going to announce in a few days that he has signed it. Um, and I think that we will get this fight this year in October or November. But Eddie Hearn always saying it's a 100% guarantee that the fight will get done, but it might not be next. It might either wait four, three to four months or seven to eight months. You know, he's always on a time rush, but he's still currently negotiating with Deontay Wilder. He knows damn well that their backs are against the wall. If Deontay Wilder signs that contract, signs on the dotted line, and sends it back to them. They know they got to make the fight. Simple as that. Nothing has been um, mandated by the WBA yet, although I guess they're putting pressure on um, Eddie Hearn to figure out what he's going to do in terms of Joshua um, Wilder. But right now, they're holding, they're holding um, tight, waiting to see because they want in on this big money fight. They won't end on it. Everybody do the WBC, the WBO, and the IBF. You know, this is a huge fight. Um, this is the biggest fight that can be made in boxing, figuratively speaking and literally speaking, um, being the biggest division uh, with the biggest man in the sport. So I think that Deontay Wilder is having fun trolling the shit out of Joshua and Eddie Hearn. He's done it for the last few days. Um, and I think that he's just having a little fun. And he's going to sign that contract, and he's going to go over there and, and fight Joshua in the U.K. But the excuses and the roadblocks and all this other shit got to stop. All the contradictions got to stop from Eddie Hearn. Make the fight or don't make the fight. Simple as that. Now the ball is, is in Deontay Wilder's um, um, court. He's been saying on Instagram, you know, be patient to people. He's replying back to uh you know, um, people's comments on his post, liking comments, stand-up guy, people chant, he, you know, he, he's interacting with people, and that's good to see. So, once he puts pen to paper, we'll have an announcement, the news will break, and we'll finally get the fight that we want to see, and that is Anthony Joshua versus Deontay Wilder for all the heavyweight titles um, and the right to be called the Undisputed heavyweight champion but you know this is boxing it's not done until it's done until that ink dry until that shit is faxed over and they receive the offer and then anthony joshua has to put pen to paper you know what i'm saying so while i think the fight will happen and i think that we close we still a few days out 
I think there will be a, a, a definitive answer this week. I don't see it going into next week. You know, um, the offer's been made. Wilder has agreed to go over to the UK. He has now gotten a contract, and now it's up to him. Now, if he doesn't sign, then we could start to look at him. But right now, he's mulling the offer. Uh, he's going to sleep on it, pray on it, whatever he got to do. And hopefully we'll get an announcement um, by the end of the week that Anthony Joshua versus Deontay Wilder will happen in October or November of 2018. And we can see the fight that we all want to see. Shout out to everybody in the movement that is moving with us. Be sure to check out 3kingsboxing.com for your latest and greatest updated, unfiltered, and unbiased boxing news. Report it the way it should be. Drop your comments in the comment section down below. Follow me on Instagram at Colossal underscore Sports TV. Till next time I'm out. Peace.